everyone. Today I am making a white tea and ginger soap with my light teal and my golden fields micas, homemade soapmakingsupplies.com. Today I'm trying a new method. I have never tried this before, but I got to thinking, why do I keep waiting for my um, oils and lyes to cool down and all that fun stuff when I think I can just take my warm lye water pour it over my oils and let that just melt my oils so I'm gonna give that a try rinse out my lye bucket okay so let's stir our oils here and see if they will melt just for curiosity's sake, my lye water was 168 and my oils were, I think they were 50 something. They were in the cold. All right, let's see where we're at. 87, 85. Yeah, I think this might work. Hot dog. That'll save me a lot of time because I really, really hate waiting for the lye water to cool down. I know that's dumb, but when I'm ready to make soap, I'm ready to make soap, and I just want to get going and get moving. Okay, so that is um, getting pretty melted there. 92, that's really good. Now, I think my friend Jamie said some other YouTuber may do this method. I have never seen anybody else do this method. Um, I'm just trying this just on the fly. Because <laughs> you guys know me, I just like to get in there and get started. Um, wow, okay, yeah. That is looking pretty good. I'm excited, yay, so excited. Okay, so I'm gonna let that melt for just a second. I am going to put in my kale and clay while we're waiting here. This is just gonna be a small batch. And then also my goat milk powder. Okay. All right, that looks pretty good. Now. so good there's my fragrance oil give me a thumbs up for remembering my fragrance oil <laughs> there's my light teal there's my golden fields and this is going to be my white Now, as usual, start with your lightest color first. there. I've taken spoon swirl just a bit. Perfect. I'm gonna tap it down. Okay. 
spray with alcohol. That will help firm up the top just a bit quicker. And we're going to put the rest of our soap straight down the middle here. And just to give our top just a little more definition, I'm going to put a white layer between my top and my uh, base soap there. Just a little bit. So now we're going to come back in, round it up in the center just a bit. with alcohol and just a little spritz of glitter love my little mica spritzers here homemade soap making supplies.com I'm going to put this under a towel and insulate it so that it will gel and then tomorrow we're going to come back and cut it 24 hours later <laughs> 